Voters in Maumee said yes to a levy request that fire officials say will strengthen their first responders. It was business as usual at the Maumee Fire Department Wednesday, a day after voters approved a 5.6 mil levy request from the department. We, we want to thank our community, period. The passage of the levy will bring the department $2.9 million annually to their operating budget. Our needs are very similar to other fire departments regionally and, and locally and even state and nationwide. It is uh, staffing changes throughout. We, we grew up on a volunteer model here in Maumee. It was not sustainable because of so many work and family dynamics that are, are stressing staff everywhere. The stress has been felt just east of Maumee at Lake Township's fire department, where officials asked voters to approve a 4.2 mil levy that would have raised 1.2 million annually for the mostly part-time department. Voters rejected the request. There's a chance that the service level is going to change. Um, we have to look at the challenges and we have to figure out how to provide the best service we can with the amount the citizens are willing to, uh, to say they can afford. Lake Township Fire Chief Barrett Dorner said if the levy had passed, the department would have hired 12 full-time firefighters. So we are going to do everything we can to keep the service as, as close to the same as we can. Uh, right now, nothing's set in stone. We are obviously always looking at grant funding and creative solutions to, to address these challenges, but things are a lot different than they were even five years ago. Back in Maumee, fire officials, along with city council, will decide how the new levy money will be used. As it gets us to a path going to look at part-time and full-time positions here. In Maumee, J.D. Pooley, 13 Action News.